here and welcome to another adventurous adventure with my brain. Damn, I forgot to set up the second light. Hi Katrina, welcome to another death-defying, awe-inspiring adventure with Katie's brain. I got my light fixed. Just gonna eat a Swedish berry. Don't worry, I did not get hipster glasses while you were in Quebec. I did not change my whole way of life and decide mainstream was too mainstream for me and I need to be non-mainstream and go out and buy myself a pair of completely mainstream glasses. These are not, not real. See, I can poke my eye, poke, poke through them. They're actually the glasses from our band performance of Blues Brothers. I just popped out the lenses because now they're cooler. Swedish berries are definitely my favorite candy. They're amazing. I don't know what I like about them so much because usually I don't like artificial sweet things. But, oh my goodness, Swedish berries are amazing. Oh, and something I can talk about while I'm talking about Swedish berries is the word raspberries because I think Swedish berries are supposed to be like raspberries. Let's check. Okay. Okay, we're going to shadow my face. Okay, I'm trying to get it. Okay, which way is right? Which way is left? Okay, bring hair light. Oh, wait, what am I doing? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Blind you, Katrina. So Swedish berries, I don't know, I think that's supposed to be like a raspberry. I'm not really sure. Is that what a raspberry looks like? Not exactly. Uh, oh my god. But anyway, the word raspberry. So I was writing it, and I can't remember why I was writing it, but I was typing it out or something. I can't remember. Anyway, back to the point. I realized raspberry has a P in it. Since when has raspberry had a P in it? I'm assuming it's always had a P in it because the English language doesn't tend to change that rapidly as in just randomly adding letters to words, but still, I feel like we should all be walking around pronouncing it like raspberries. Raspberries. Why? Like, why? Basically, raspberries have forever changed for me. They've changed. They've just changed, man. I don't know exactly how they've changed. But there's something different about them now that there's a other letter in there. Rasp. 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 Just sounds evil. I just figured it out. There's a breaking news from Katie's brain. Oh, we should have a sound for breaking news. Oh, I'm gonna get a sound. I don't know if this makes a sound, but it's really cute, so I'd like to use it. Breaking news from Katie's brain! Raspberries are evil. Pure evil, in fact. And that is why zombies, not the zombies we all know and love, well, love, I, moving on. Not the zombies we all know, but the zombies that are a slight deviation off of the normal zombies. See, they have a slight mutation in their zombie essness that makes it so that instead of craving brains and with an insatiable desire, insatiable? Insatiable? They crave raspberries. Watch out for this, Katrina. This has been a special broadcast from Katie's Brain. <laughs> Thank you, Katrina, for taking me out of the freezer. I really appreciate it. It's not good in the freezer. Just don't think about putting me back in there, okay? Or else who knows where you might end up. Excuse us while Katie has a momentary lapse of sanity. To be fair, she doesn't often have a lot of sanity, but right now it is alarmingly low. Now that you've posted the unveiling of my Harry Potter house, I feel like I can talk about it a little bit. I, as you know, got Gryffindor. I'm wearing some red to symbolize my house pride. Actually, no, that was a complete coincidence. I just like this shirt, and I wear it a lot. It says awesome on it, and it has Hello Kitty. And it's red, so. And yes, I do still think it's a little bit funny that I got Gryffindor. I definitely thought it was going to be Hufflepuff. I'm surprised. I'm especially surprised because I'm pretty sure to one question I answered crying in a corner. Or I think maybe crying in a corner wasn't an option, but I'm pretty sure I answered the closest possible answer to crying in a corner. But there you go, maybe I am more of a Neville Longbottom Gryffindor, and I just 
I don't do that much, and then when it really counts and Voldemort's there trying to kill everyone, I just come out and show how bamf and awesome I am. So, let me know when Voldemort gets here. Bye, Katrina! I, I love you like a love song, baby. I, I love you like a love song, baby. I, I love you like a love song, baby. And I keep hitting rip, 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 rip.